Hello everyone and welcome back to Flight Sim 2020 where we have the new update from Asobo, the Top Gun free DLC. And I am looking to check out the challenges that it has added. Of course we already had the F-A-18 and they did do some tweaks to the F-A-18 in the latest sim update and I haven't tried it out since so it may perform differently than I have experienced it before so we'll see how it handles. But I'm going to go straight into the challenges and see how it goes with these low altitude challenges. And then there are these advanced challenges including the uh, landing on the carrier thing. That I'll save for a different video. We'll try the low altitude challenges first. I have not tried any of these yet. And we'll see how it goes. We already have scores here and the scores are displaying. Last time I did challenges in the game they didn't display the scores properly but we do have a world top 10 there with Nuclear Pickle 87 at the top. And there's a ghost apparently that did 840,000 points. Okay. Uh, maintain low altitude to score high. So it's a combination of altitude and speed, I take it. All right. Well, I haven't seen this course before, so we will see how it goes. Obviously, as you become familiar with a course, then you'll be able to optimize your speed and height accordingly. Ooh, fancy. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Um, can I can I be in the cockpit though? Okay, thank you. What is all that mess? Um, uh, maybe I have a mod that I don't know what's all that, but okay. I I think something has gone horribly wrong. <laughs> I don't know if it's reading my throttle. But I don't have any, you know, anything. Well, this is inconvenient. Okay. I mean, when it says goal... Okay, well... I don't even know where to... I don't know if I can throttle right now. Oh, well, I hear some sound. Oh, right, this has the afterburner. Oh, okay, right, I had to click to do afterburner. I was going, why does it feel like I'm going so slow? I mean, of course, I am at a loss as far as information is concerned right now. Do I have to cry across here? It seems like the ghost did. Oh, there's a... we can go down there. Oh, yeah, I could follow... Well, I mean, is it worth following it a little bit better? I mean, the water? I don't know. Okay, well, I made up some time cutting across. But uh, this is all very distressing, <laughs> as far as the data is concerned. Um, I think I should go this way. Oh, there's the ghost. Well, I was caught off guard by the weird... UI issues and maybe that there I have a mod that I don't remember putting in and that's causing the problem or maybe there's just a problem I don't know I also forgot all about afterburner and how it works here it's just not it's not just throttle up it's oh gosh where am I going now uh, I think I'm going to the right here um yeah, you have to click a button to activate the afterburner, so it took me some time to remember that. Oh, well, looks like we can go down here. Ooh. Well, I've got more points than the ghost, but because I've been keeping lowered in it.
I mean, I guess it doesn't really matter, the data and all. <laughs> Does it really matter how fast I'm going? I don't know. Okay, I reached the goal. 1.226 million points. Uh, not at the top of the leaderboard, but I can do better if I have some information. It's a very straight path. Hmm. And, yeah, if I started out with Afterburner, that'd be helpful. But let me try and fix the HUD issue first, and the instrument issue, I don't know. We'll see. Okay, so I have deleted some livery mods for the F-18 in the hope that that fixes things, but I have no idea whether it will. And I'm gonna try that one one more time, this time remembering to activate the Afterburner. Ridge crossing maneuver. I don't know the ridge crossing maneuver. Maybe I should learn that. Okay. It shows my afterburner on. Let me just verify. Okay, good. Let's get nice and low. Still don't know what the bonus is for being low, though. Got some points. Okay, well, I mean, my HUD is still messed up. <laughs> I suppose that's obvious. I don't know why. I don't know why the HUD is showing information from one of the multifunction displays, and the multifunction displays are basically showing all the information at once, is basically what I'm feeling is happening here. Uh, which way do I go here again? Uh, I think I'll, uh, I'll go this way. I don't know which way to go. Forgot that part. Well, clearly too high for that part. Oh, he sounds like he's gonna hurl. Oh, I lost points. I don't think I went the right way. I should have gone into the valley. Nah, I lost a lot of points there.
I basically got the same score, so that's not great. I deviated here. I should have gone left. I missed that. That was the biggest mistake there. That's where everything started to go wrong. You can see I was ahead of the ghost for all of it until right there. Uh, this was probably a missed opportunity as well. Okay, so yeah, let me just check how the plane is. Maybe the plane is supposed to be messed up in the challenges? I don't know. So let's just take it on a quick flight without those. Well, I fixed the problem by just moving everything out of the community folder, so no mods right now, and it does fix the HUD and the panels, so... Well, something was messing with it, but it wasn't directly one of the F-18 liveries or anything like that. So something weird is happening, but I will take too long to figure out exactly which mod it is. So we're just going to proceed with the second challenge, which is this Ridge Mountains one. And well, we'll see how it goes. The ghost got 1.2 million and the top is 1.58. So there's not a lot of margin between the ghost and the top 10 here. So that's fairly interesting. Uh, let's see how it goes. Okay. It shows me with Afterburner, but... Okay. I just want to make sure. That probably lost me some speed. Well, I need to go down. This doesn't look like your normal canyon kind of thing. So I don't know, should I just be going straight or should I be... I don't know why I'm supposed to be following here. So, it said Ridge Mountains. Ooh, I got minus 30,000, so that's not good. Probably went the wrong way. I guess I should be weaving around the mountains or something. Well, I made up some there. Okay. Well, I guess we'll just try and keep it as low as possible. Doesn't seem like low terrain over there. I don't even know where the ghost plane went. Oh, uh, well, we'll skip over some of this. I'm just going in a straight line mostly. I don't know where I'm going. We'll see at the end where I was supposed to go. I mean, this is just how it is. I don't know. Well, that wasn't too many extra points there. Well, there's a nice little river here. Rivers are always good at getting the lowest possible terrain and everything. Um, it's going over there. Oh, minus points. Um, apparently does not like this strategy. Well, okay. I'm just going to go for the gold, darn it. I'm not going to beat any records, that's for sure. I have no idea where I'm supposed to go here. Well, 1.2 million, basically the same as the ghost, but alright. You got me. Where where were, where were you supposed to go? Alright, um... I don't see any physical features along this. <laughs> um, you know, th there are ridges here, but... 
It doesn't look like we're following anything here. It wants uh, to go this way, but that's a longer ridge. I sort of matched paths here, and we went totally different over there. Okay, so when it says five, I need to hang a right. And then hang a left and eight. Let me try it. We'll restart. But otherwise, I guess, wow, it was be followed by. It wasn't anything to be followed by. It really isn't very particular. As long as we go low and fast, there isn't anything. It's mostly a straight line. That's what I'm trying to say. <laughs> Wondering how close I can get to the trees without being in trouble. I probably should have gone right there. Ooh, ah, ooh, I crashed. Oh, it gives me gets us back on track after we crash? Oh, that's cheating. Ah, uh, but it's not gonna be any good. Let's just restart. I should have gone right there. This is way too high. Okay, section four. Section five is the one where I have to go right. Okay, well, let's see. I don't know where to the right I'm supposed to go. Oh, it's along a ridge, but I don't even know which ridge. Maybe over there somewhere. I don't know. Oh, you know what? Let's go over here. Oh, minus points though. Okay. Well, uh... Alright. I don't feel like this deviation has been to my benefit. Not so much. Okay. Wow, lots of bad points on Section 8. I don't even know. Section 8 I was supposed to go left, but I'm not sure. Uh, I guess along the river valley here. Nah, this wasn't a very good strategy. Ooh, nice, nice rocks there. Well, that was even worse than last time. I don't think that was 
useful. Okay. Oh, well, I um, I went a little bit. I, I overdid it <laughs> as far as going left and right. It is mostly a straight line. Uh, really, following the track doesn't matter. Let's just go for the next one. Uh, so 1.3 million the ghost got, and the top person 1.7 million. Okay, here we go. No, okay, well there's the goal. I don't know where the really fast ghost plane is since the ghost plane did really well on this one. I'm assuming we go this way. Whoa, a little bit too much height there. Okay, see a gap there. All right, well, we have to go up or I think we have to go up here. Oh, we could have gone around, shoot. The height is definitely the more important thing, I feel, rather than the... Oh, shoot. Rather than the time. Well... I lost more points than that for that mess. Uh, is it this way? Okay, well that's interesting. <laughs> okay, those mountains are really tall. Which way do I go? Which way do I go? That's probably way high. Lost points like crazy there. Definitely missed the valley. Well, I'm pretty consistent about 1.2 million, aren't I? Still a B. Well, mostly follow the course except right around here-ish. I went the wrong way. And there-ish I really went the wrong way. Uh, definitely lost points over here a lot. Uh, right at the end especially. Hmm. Okay, well, I'll just try the next one. Alaska. Well, we start out pretty high on this one. I really need to more aggressively push its nose down sometimes. There's an interesting one because the to dark and light patches might be sometimes deceptive as far as their location and height. I think I want to go left, but I'm not sure. 
Uh, maybe right. Let's try right. Wow. No, that's just a big mountain there. That's not good. Yeah, well, there goes the height bit. Well, I got some more on section 7. Leaving game area? Uh-oh. Wait a second. The goal is right there. Seems like bad playing on their part. Okay. Ooh, this is hardly rendered at all right now. Okay, well, 1.3 million. I mean, it's an improvement. A this time. So 1.3 million is what you need for an A on these things, it looks like. Oh, wow, I, I really took a completely different route, didn't I? <laughs> um, uh, I mean, not too bad considering that. Especially on number 8. Mines might be better at that point. It, that sure makes up for what I lost on here and here. In fact, even this part made up for what I lost there and there. It's nice that they give you some freedom to pick where you want to go, but... Yeah, I guess over here I really came close to the edge. I guess the rectangle here represents the game area, as they call it. Alright, well, let's go... Maverick menu, and let's try the final one. And wow, this one was tough apparently because the top score was 1.4 million and the ghost is 774,000. So, Toyabi Canyon. They give you this sort of thing here. It looks like we'll have to turn left here. But they don't give you the course, or the course that the ghost took. I, mean, I guess we could sort of plan something out. This one does look more like a river canyon. Like, there's a lake here, and then there's a river going around. And we just follow the river quite a lot, and then up here. So I think that's the plan. I mean, it is a canyon, so... That means that following the river is a good idea. Okay, here we go. Well, we haven't acquired a river yet. It's just a it says checkpoint. I guess that was that's the bit before the turn. Wow, I got really a lot better than... Okay, where is the river anyway? <laughs> I was supposed to follow a river around here. I'm racking up points though. I'm guessing this is not the way I should have gone though. I'm probably gonna lose some points. Oh, no, I'm getting well... Better than the... Ghost, though. But the ghost did pr pretty poorly on this one. I feel like I went the wrong way. 
Oh, the ghost is right there, though. Oh, there's a river. Uh, well, there's a, there's a canyon, anyway. Uh... not good. Yeah, I lost points there. Went the wrong way, definitely. Uh, okay. <laughs> I don't see the marker for the checkpoint anymore. Shouldn't they show that? Oh, okay, I blacked out. Okay, so I went in a bad location. Okay. Oh, well, I got some points though, but... Okay. Let's restart that. Yeah, let's just go straight for that checkpoint. Well, this part is... Uh, over there it looks good. Oh, this is leaving game area? No, it looks so good over here. Ah, uh, well, okay, I guess that part is too good. Alright, let's restart. We'd be free and clear if we went over there. Yeah, the ghost plane definitely did not optimize height around here. The sections sure do pass by really quickly. Seems like a much shorter thing than previous ones. Well, just to avoid getting out of the boundaries, I might as well just stay pointed at the checkpoint, darn it. Because it seems like the boundaries are pretty tight. Main thing is to stay low. Not try anything too fancy. We lost some points there, though. Okay, I think... Oh, the goal is... Uh, we have to hang a left, that's why. Uh, this part, I'm losing a lot, and... Yeah, because of the left turn. Well, only 1.1 million there, but everybody else sort of did worse too. That's a B there. I'm I'm the blue line, right? <laughs> so I was supposed to actually go a little bit further before turning. Is that what they're saying? Okay, well, I think that'll do it for me for now. So that was my first taste of these low altitude challenges. I wish they had had one like in the Grand Canyon that really had a lot of twists and turns. These are mostly straight. Uh, there, there's some optimization to do, obviously, but mm, not as much maneuvering as I thought. In fact, uh, I guess you're meant to keep your engines at full throttle the whole way. Uh, I would like 
uh, low altitude challenge like the Grand Canyon where you have to throttle down and manage your throttle correctly or you won't make the turn, you see. Uh, I don't feel like the, any of these are like that, where if you try and go full throttle through it, you're going to die kind of things. Um, there is a, There was a mod for DCS where you could do such things with the F-14 down the Grand Canyon, and that was fun. But anyway, so uh, interesting... Uh, I will try them again sometime to try and get a better score. But there you have it. Those are the five low altitude challenges. And I will do the carrier landing challenge in a separate video and then explore this strat stratospheric flight with this dark star. Apparently it can go Mach 10 and 150,000 feet. So that deserves its own thing. But for now, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please do press like. If you have any comments or suggestions, please leave them in the comment section below. And I'll see you next time.